Hello everyone, and welcome back. Today, we're going to be playing Steins Gate. Let's begin. すべては偶然だ。だがその偶然は荒かじめ決められていた世界の意志でもあった。俺は行かれてなどいない。至って正常だ。ここでは真実を語っているんであって、断じて中二病の妄想なんかじゃない。きっかけはほんの些細なことだ
っぷりとその考えについて聞かせてもらうつもりじゃ何機関が動き出しているだとそれがシュタインズゲートの選択かエル・サイ・コンビ Of course, this is enemy territory. I can just stride through the front door like an average person. I bypass the elevators and escalators and head to the 8th floor by the stairwell. But I only make it to the 7th floor before I have to stop and rest. The girl, Shina Mayu,、uh, Mayuri, immediately resumes our conversation. She followed me all the way here, and she isn't even short of breath. I, on the other hand, am gasping for air with my hands on my knees. Who would have thought an eight story building would be so tall? I turn to May,、uh, Mayuri, while wiping the sweat off my brow. Kikuna, so they got Mayuri no tame de boy. Mayuri smiles happily and doesn't pry any further. As always, she is quick to understand her position. We know each other since we were both little. Mayuri is 16, two years younger than me, so she's more like a little sister than a typical childhood friend. I've been looking out for her as long as I can remember. I used to hope that Mayuri might become the key to the Stein's gate, but now I've reconsidered her. I don't want that terrible fate on for her. She should live a normal life. That is my first wish. We continue to the 8th floor and enter the assembly hall. In front of us stands a cheap looking stage with a hoodie and a sign reading Dr. Nakabachi. My Yuri and sister call me Okari, but it's neither my new name, my new name nor my code name. It's just one of those annoying nicknames that we use. My Yuri, you always say it. I'm going to call you Okari. Eh? But in the past, I used to call you Okari. それは昔の話だ今の俺は法院狂魔<笑>世界中の秘密組織から狙われる狂気のマッドサイエンティストだ<笑><笑>だって難しくて覚えられないし<笑>ホーオーウィン・キョーマ is my true name <笑>それに岡部凛太郎と一文字も合ってないよおかしいね<笑><笑> Cease your foolish laughter 岡部岡部凛太郎 Maybe my real name but I have rejected it for it is stupid for it is stupid And so I hate the derivative. So, and so I hate the derivative. Okay, then. Come on, it's 
sounds like that elf boy's blue pipe thing. Pied Piper? So, oh, oh. In one ear, in one ear and not the other. She's been calling me for that. She's been calling me that for five years now. So maybe it's time to give up. お前はそれも知らずここまで俺についてきたというのか。うん。She's Nakabachi is an inventor. He appears on TV from time to time and has a few patients under his belt, but mostly he is treated as a curiosity. Mayuri's right. I've scanned the entire hall, but there's no one who looks like a reputable reporter on the or cameraman. There are only about 10 of us standing in the hall, including me. Considering Nakabachi's moderate media presence and the fact that he claims to have invented a time machine, I would have expected more. I twist my lips into a sneer. I thought Nakabachi was like me, a scientist fighting to overthrow the organization. But this press conference suggests other motives at work. Our enemy won't miss this chance. <laughs> Nevertheless, I'm interested in what he has to say. That's why I'm here, blowing an afternoon of my precious summer holiday. Mayuri ponders my utterance for a while before finally turning her head. <laughs> I let out a sigh. Oh. <laughs> Mayuri is known not only to make bad jokes, but to laugh at them too. She's always been special. Mayuri, Kyosuke. I didn't even finish my sentence. Are we under attack? Are they trying to fry our brains with electromagnetic wave? Waves. Dust fall from the ceiling as the floor shakes. We're definitely under attack. It's coming from above and we're on the top floor. All that's above is the roof. No time to deal with the Mayuri's confusion. Something's not right about this. I bolt out of the top of the hall and run up the stairs to the roof, ignoring the no trespass of signing my wife. The door is open upon his closer front I feel like the lock is broken. I open the door and see a billowing cloud of black smoke. There's some kind of phosphoric dust sparkling in the air. Bakuhatsu? Dato! Bakuhatsu? I can't believe it. Was it really an explosion? My heart is racing. Damn I don't know what to do. Should I run away? But why an explosion? Terrorists? No, that doesn't fit. I mean, how do you explain that? <laughs> A strange machine is sitting in the middle of the room. It's huge, maybe three meters tall. It looks like something looks kind of like a settler. That thing caused the shaking just now. 
Who put it here? Was it Dr. Nakabachi in his, his, his part of his presentation? Impossible. Even if that were the case, how the hell would you get it up here? My head is bursting with questions. As I search for the courage to report to the machine, the wrong of reporters and building staff burst the onto the rooftop. They look just as confused as I am. The little woman, who I assume is a staff member, pulls away the staff. Oh. Is she trying to hide something? Her response was unusually quick, almost like she's trying to keep me away from that device. This is new. Inbound new. I want to know, but I shouldn't risk getting in any closer. I turn and move. But not because I'm scared or anything like that. <laughs> Staff members lead us all back to the eighth floor. Mayuri is no longer the same. She's not in the same. I find her on the seventh floor. Several capsule board machines are lined up next to a plate reading the birthplace of Japanese PC. The Japanese PC. No. She gazes upon him, a wistful look. I breathe a sigh of relief, then take out my phone. What's <laughs> <laughs> After I speak the words and hang up, I am able to wipe the sweat from my forehead. <laughs> my sweat is cold. Half of me hopes that something will happen, the other half fears the same thing. I put away my phone and look back at my ear. Still staring. She's still staring at me. She's still staring at those capsule boys. She doesn't seem to be worried about the explosion at all. Fuck this. <laughs> I can't decide if she's lovable or just an air. Mayuri, Nani will see you. as I thought. Mayuri points to a castle machine. The sign of the front says Rainet Kakeru 3D character doll series. Rainet Kakeru is a popular anime series with its own card game. Spin-off. Rainet Excess Battlers. They even hold international tournaments. Upa is a series mascot character. It resembles an epileptical. What? Epileptical. Epileptical. Egg with limbs sticking out, like some kind of deformed dog. It's what they call an ugly, cute character. High school girls find these creatures adorable for some reason. Last year, an ugly frog character was the rage. Its name escapes me though. Yareba <laughs> Mayuri gives a troubled smile. Mayuri is what Mayuri calls herself sometimes. According to her, it's supposed to have an Star at the end. Mayurishi. Star. But who really cares? She holds her out her hands with a look like a begging puppy. Aww. Looks like she was planning for this from the very beginning. Well, at least she didn't 
<laughs> I pull out a Hyaku Yen coin, set it into the machine slot, and spin it, spin the lever. <gasps> Honestly, you really didn't need to say coin at the end. Yen would have sufficed. I open the capsule and take out the contents. Mayori leans forward eagerly to see what I got. Ah! Upa da yo! Shikamo metal! Metal upa! Sore wa rea na no ka? Uh, there's something about this voice actor that feels so familiar. Hmm. He's good though. <laughs> While I examine the metal upa, a boy who is watching us tries his luck on the scene that I next machine. Ah, Futsuno upa da. Yeah. He looks at my metal upa in resentment. I turn to see Mayuri's spot, sparkling eyes, also fixed on my upa. Hey, high school girl. <clears throat> You're acting like a little kid. <laughs> Deva Mayuri ni kurete yaro. Honestly, I don't want it. Honto! Ino! Okari! Ino. Oh, in kyoma da! ハンジツはドクター中町による。タイムマシン発明成功記念会見にお集まりいただき、誠にありがとうございます。おう。オッケー。I Wait a minute, how do I? Wait, hold on, what is this? But Mayuri doesn't follow. Okay. Is there a way to save this? Oh, that's how you do it. Okay, guys. Uh, I'll see you all next time. We're out of time. Uh, so just trying this out for the first time. Never played this game. So, I guess I'll give it a try. Hopefully I'll see you all next time. See you later.